So welcome back to our exploration in Minecraft Education Edition Lessons in Good Trouble. Now, if you saw some of our other videos, you notice that we've been to just about every movement. We went to those four on the left, we went to Gandhi, and now we are going to learn a little bit about the women's suffrage movement in London. In the early 1900s, I was one of the leaders of a movement that shaped the idea that women deserve the right to vote in the United Kingdom. Come back to 1918 London with me to learn more about our achievement. Okay, so let's jump to London. Here we are, and like always, we're greeted by Congressman John Lewis. Now I'd like to introduce you to Emmeline Pankhurst, who was a catalyst for good trouble in London way back in the early 1900s. The founder of the Women's Franchise League, she helped to organize and lead the women's suffrage movement, which helped white British women win the right to vote. All right, and now let's hear from Emmeline. Hi, John. I advocated for married women to have the right to vote. I also helped to establish the Women's Social and Political Union. We protested through hunger strikes. We sometimes engaged in physical confrontations for the purpose of the movement. We used to pronounce it suffragettes because we intended to get the vote and we did. So before we explore this world, like a lot of the other figures in Minecraft in, in this particular world, there is a button that will share more information about the women's suffrage movement. And as you can see, that directs you to National Geographic for Kids. That has this great page. It says facts about the suffragettes, sharing a lot of really interesting information and articles that are written at the reading level that your students, especially if they're younger, should be able to understand. So let's jump back into our world. This is an interesting world because it involves a lot of exploring and running around. So this is London in the early 1900s. And let's take a look at this. This is a newsletter written by, you can see at the bottom there, Christabel Pankhurst, the daughter of Emmeline, who we just met. So, as Emmeline told us, voting is now legal for women, but if you go over here and go to the polls, which you see right over here, you can see that mostly men are the ones that are inside here in the polls. And you really can't do anything inside here um, other than just be able to view. So this is going to set the stage for the activity that we'll be completing during this part of the world. The women of London can now vote. Share the good news with the women of our city and let them know their voice can now be heard. After you talk to all eight of them, the London gates shall open. So as you can see right over here to the right, our job for this world is just to simply get the word out and to find women and let them know that they now have the right to vote. So I'm just going to turn right over here. We have one person standing right outside. Whoops. So I'm just going to turn right over here. Let's talk to Rebecca. Vote you say. I thought I saw a lass or two in that queue. I'm gonna finish my drink and march right over there to cast my vote. Okay, and you will notice that we have Rebecca and she shows up in green. So our whole goal of this world is to really just get the vote, get the word about women's right to vote out. So here is Hannah. Okay, we have Hannah on there. I see another woman right over here on the sidewalk. This is Charlene. Okay, now at some point it gets a little bit tougher to locate women in this town. You've got these different rooms. Some of the doors open, some of the doors don't. 
believe this is the library. Those yellow names, which sometimes show up. All right, I see that Mary is located inside here. Here is Mary. We now have Mary, so we're about halfway done. Let's go inside the library and see if we can find anyone. Here's someone. And we're just going to keep going around here to see if there is anyone else. There's Hortense. We'll have a couple left. Here we go. I'm going to try leaving the library now and just running this way. Just want to see if there's those last th two or three women. Here's Emma. It's going to let Emma know that she now can vote. There we go. It says that I did it. So it looks like now the gates, the London gates are now open and that all women now in London during this time in 1918 now are able to vote. So I'm just going to head back to our green beam Gonna head now to John Lewis. When you're ready, let's return to our modern times so I can share a few final thoughts. Walk through the gates or use the button to fast travel. So again, that is the women's suffrage movement in London of this part of Lessons in Good Trouble.